guy this video. I did a review on the Jordan 1 Mochas earlier this month, well, I guess last month. And, you know, the hype was all sneaker of the year talk type hype, you know. Hype be saying this, hype be saying that. But the real talk sneaker of the year, in my opinion, is this sneaker right here. And you can probably already tell what sneaker it is because of the box. But, guys, like, how, 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 how aren't these? Like, how not? You know what I'm saying? Like, I understand everybody sits up there and hypes it because it's off white and everybody hypes it because it's you know a different silhouette but let's let's be let's be 100 percent honest here i don't own any off-white um i don't plan on owning any off-white i've heard it's all hype i heard the materials like the quality of the clothing is okay but it's not worth 300 dollars a t-shirt um but these sneakers are a different story, mainly because you're paying the normal price, which would be two twenty-five or two fifty. Actually, it's not normal price. I think some flats come out at one ninety, but it's a collab, so you're expected to pay a little bit more. So about two twenty-five, two fifty, I think is the price range. Um, and like you're getting a good quality sneaker. Okay, so I actually wore this um, Supreme um, natural colored crew neck. So you guys can kind of get an idea of the coloring on the sneaker. It looks like it actually matches um, the sneaker or the hoodie actually matches the sneaker in this film that I'm like in the video right now. But when you actually see the coloring, it's almost like a piss yellow on these. And I just dig that a lot. I don't think I've seen any sneakers that have done that. Um, I also like the Jordan 5 that they came out with either beginning of this year or, early, or, or late last year or something like that. The all black one. I like that off white 5 as well. But I like this one more because of the red hints, the black sole, the, the red 23. You got the black Nike Air on the back, the red Jumpman on the tongue with the reflective tongue. I also like how the tongues have like the circles on them. Like this is just, this is just an immaculate sneaker. Um, my personal opinion, 10 out of 10, as, as as you can tell, I've been hyping it. I also believe this is sneaker of the year. Um, and I personally believe that because, one, I mean, they have limited stock. But two, if you look at this quality, if you've seen the Off-White 4s, or if you've seen these in general, if you've even seen the Off-White 5s, they're doing this type of material where it's like you have extra left over. Um, and it's kind of cool. Like I just, I've never seen that done on a sneaker before. So in terms of, you know, new innovative things that Nike is coming out with and that Virgil and Nike are thinking of, this is definitely like, they're going in the right direction with these type of sneakers. Um, the fours, the fives, the ones, I mean, they're all tough in general, but they're going in the right direction with this. Um, they're coming out with different colors. They're doing different schemes. They're adding different textures. They're doing different, like, it's just different and I dig it. They also come with extra laces, a red and a black pair, which I, and I'll probably end up keeping these in because I like the natural color. But just an overall dope sneaker, guys. Um, and when you guys see the on foot, you'll see how well they mesh with pants. And I mean, it is just so easy to wear these with anything. Um, in terms of keeping, these would definitely be staying in my collection for a long time to come. They go with a lot of things. Let me rephrase that. They go with a lot of pants. In terms of things, it's actually harder than you'd think to match because I'm like the type of person where I want to match color with color. So it's hard to find a color that goes directly with the color on these sneakers. And you have your red and you have your black with that piss yellow sole, but I just, I, I'm sorry. I just would rather match the color of the sneaker than do like, you know, all red or all black top. I, I'm, I'm more of a color matcher. Um, I did get these in an eight and a half, um, and I will be honest with you, I wear a nine faithfully, and the eight and a half does not cause me any issues. I can wear them with elite socks, I can wear them with chunky socks, I can wear them with, you know, and by chunky, I mean thick. You can wear them, I mean, honestly, you could probably go a half size down and be okay. I'm not recommending you to do that, but if you have a deal set up where you can get a half size smaller 
for a steal, which is what happened with me. I actually got these for a steal and they're eight and a half. I think they were worn maybe once or twice when I got them. And now that I'm looking at prices that are eight or that are seven or 800 and I'm not paying it. But if you can get a half size down, I'd recommend doing that and just take the sole out. I don't even have to take the sole out, but if you want to take the sole out, I mean, there's multiple ways that you can finesse a smaller size or even a bigger size if you can't find your size for the price that you want to pay. But like I said, you could probably squeeze into a half size smaller than your actual size. Um, like I said, I'm not recommending that, but I definitely would say that if you can do it, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and do that if you want to. But you even got the, the Nike Air on the inside with the uh, Virgil writing. I mean, it's just it's just an immaculate shoe, immaculate, immaculate shoe. Um, it comes with your uh, lace locks, just the uh, laces, say shoelaces. I mean, you just can't go wrong with picking this sneaker up. Um, I do give it shoe of the year, and I do not like. I will not. I don't think anything else is gonna come out this year that is gonna you know take that 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 trophy away from these. But hey, you never know. Um, the off white fours are definitely close runner ups, but. This just has more color to it, if you were to ask me. The Off-White 4s are just all over cream, and that's nice, you know what I mean? But I like how this has more color to it. It's not an all-over cream. It's an all-over cream with a boom, black and yellow and red and all this other type with the reflective sole. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. This easily takes the, the uh, crown for me. But um, I was so excited to finally get this video out to you guys. So I'm glad if you've stayed tuned and watched through all the way through. I appreciate you guys for watching all the way through. Um, I will get you guys some on feet. So I do hope that you guys enjoy the on feet views. Um, like always, guys, I truly, truly, truly do appreciate the support. I appreciate you guys for watching as always. Um, I'm still trying to think of some new giveaways that I'm going to end up doing here on the channel soon. So stay tuned for that as well. Um, but all in all... If you like this video please leave a like comment and subscribe definitely leave your opinion on what you think on these down in the comment section because i would love to see what you guys think on these and i'll probably get back to you guys in the comment section as well but like always guys just stay safe um if i don't have another video up by christmas i should but if i don't i wish you guys a merry christmas and as always guys i appreciate you guys for watching and stay tuned for more to come peace
Thank you.